As soon as the body of Kenya's second president, Daniel Toroitich Arap Moi, arrived at the Lee funeral home, leaders from across the political divide made their way here to condole with Moi's family and pay their respects. Deputy President William Ruto, who considered Mze a mentor and a friend, praised him for retiring from active politics when his term in office expired, terming this as a challenge to the younger generation on matters nation building. It is sad to say goodbye to a man whose legacy we all feel, and we thank the Almighty God for the gift of Mze Moi's leadership. In this sad moment of great loss, therefore, let us still rejoice because of what he did for his countrymen and women. ODM leader Raila Odinga on his part hailed Moi for his commitment to a united Kenya since he took over office in 1978. ANC leader Musalia Mudavadi, who also served as vice president, praised the late Mze Moi for defending the constitution by not clinging to power, terming him as a true statesman. Jifunza mengi kutoka kwake vile serikali inatakana yaendeshwe na isitoshe. Kwa kimombo kuna lile neno wanaita humility. Huyu Mze haku wana maringo. Various leaders also took to social media to pay tribute. Tanzanian President John Pombe Magufuli mourned President Moi as a leader who was keen on strengthening ties between neighboring countries, while his Ugandan counterpart President Yoweri Museveni condoled with Moi's family, recalling his early meetings with Moi, describing him as a real East African. In his hometown of Kabarak, residents here celebrated him the only way they knew how. Many more leaders had personal memories that will remain with them even with the death of Daniel Arap Moi. Apart from his leadership for 24 years as the president of the Republic of Kenya, many will remember Daniel Arap Moi through his contributions in different sectors in the country. Robbie Omondi, K24, Nairobi.